Hi, this is Kat with Vita Halik, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Crystal FX Pickup Artist. Now, this is actually a really fun tool, and I'm glad that we brought it in. This is from the Beadsmith, and let me talk about a few of the features on this tool first. So this black part here, this is actually a waxed tip, so that's gonna help us pick up our flat backs and place them onto our surface. And then these two little arms out here, you can see that they're different sizes. So we have our small little tip and our large tip, and these are positioning tools. So these are gonna be great to kind of help move around our flat backs if we need to sort of adjust them without getting uh, the sticky end involved, which could pick it up from the glue. So you're gonna be able to use these positioning tools once you've placed your flat back onto your glue. Now another neat little thing is it actually comes with this little scoop. And I've been using this just to kind of like push things around on my table, but it's also really great to scoop up those flat backs when you're done working with them. All right, so I have a little project here on my table, and this is the peppermint candy earring. So this I've actually completed, so let me just kind of show you what it looks like there. So it was really easy to place those flat backs in those nice little straight lines there, and I was using some GS Hypo Cement, which I'm gonna show you how to do this today. And I'm just gonna place mine in a little bit more of a random order today, so you can place them however you want, and this is a great little tool to kind of figure out how you want them to place. And as I was doing this particular one, I could use this back edge to kind of nudge them a little bit as well to make sure that line was nice and straight. So there's a lot to be said for this particular tool and it's actually really easy to work with. So I'm gonna show you. All right, so I have some GS Hypo Cement. Like I said, this is probably going to be one of the better glues I suggest using. It's not as um, sort of sticky and tacky as like an E6000 might be that you might have a lot of string attached to it. So what I'm gonna do here is just take a little bit, and the other great thing about GS Hypo Cement is you'll see when I open it, it has a little pinpoint, which is gonna be great for precision work. All right, so I'm gonna set that aside. So all I need to do is just figure out where I want my glue to land, or where I want my flat back to be, and I'm just gonna place a little dab of glue right there. And now I can kind of set that aside, and I recommend kind of setting it on a piece of paper because that will sort of dribble as it, as it sits there. So now we're gonna take our pickup artist, and again, that is a waxed little tip, so you can just go and just pick it up and place it onto where the glue is. Just kind of hold it for a second and you can just sort of rotate it off and just pick it up. But then you can use your little positioning tool to kind of get it where you want it to be or kind of smush it down in there or just kind of place it right on top and you kind of see from the side I can do it that you just sort of place it and just make sure that it's nice and secure. And then as you're working you can just sort of place your glue and then place your flat back. So it makes it really nice and super, super easy to do. And then just again, just kind of move that around or place it as you need. <laughs> All right, so that is how to use the Crystal FX Pickup Artist. I hope you enjoyed this video. You can get all of these supplies and see even more tutorial videos by heading over to beataholic.com.